What's going on, everybody? Rob Anderson, Clean Power Wash, Salisbury, Maryland. Um, I want to talk to you about gloves, and I know that uh, I'm sure that I'm going to get some comments on here. Hey, man, toughen up. You don't need gloves, blah, blah, blah. Um, let's see, let me fix this up light here. Uh, let's try here. Whatever. Um, so I'm not working in a shop right now. And even when we're not in the shop, when we're out doing work, um, because I, I'm, I'm a big proponent for having gloves. Um, and, and the big reason why is that if you've ever worn gloves, every single time that they cut them, get cut or get torn is a time that your skin probably would have been gashed or nicked up, and started bleeding. And I don't know about you guys, but between the bleach between the different soaps, between all the dirt and grime and let's just say less than sanitary water a lot of time that we're dealing with, um, I'd much rather not get that stuff in my hands. Um, so I want to show you a couple different gloves and whatnot. Um, these are the wrong kind of gloves. These are the cheap gloves from Sam's Club. I thought that that's where I bought my last set. Um, these ones, you've probably seen the Venom gloves, and I'll have to, actually, sorry, let's go like that. Venom, there we go. Uh, these are decent. Um, you know, if you got nothing else, um, the problem with the Venom gloves, they're extremely thin. Um, you know, they, they work okay. Um, they're not that durable. You're going to go through... Yeah, at least two to five gloves per job, especially if you're doing any gutter cleaning um, or if you're even working around the shop. These ones, though, these ones are Microflex Safe Grip ones. I get these on Amazon. I thought I got them somewhere local, but clearly I got them on Amazon. I got the extra large size. 50 bucks. Uh, I think I paid like $13. So they're basically 25 cents a glove. Here's the difference, though. These gloves are a whole lot thicker with the cold weather that we've been working out in. It's a lot better, um, more durable. It's got, you know, they're, what are they? Mill. Does it say? Whatever. They're powder free latex examination gloves. Guys, these are very, very solid. Um, I will usually, and, and most of my techs, if I can convince them not to just toss them after each job. Um, I'll get two or three days out of these gloves, out of one set of gloves. Um, and they, they hold up a lot better to, we've got some hose clamps and stuff that'll sometimes run across a hand and man, skin just wants to rip on that. This stuff will give and come back in place. They feel nice, they're a little bit longer. So as opposed to this one just goes just past the wrist um, these ones actually, if you're really, truly, if you're wearing long sleeve shirts, um, they'll get you inside there versus these ones are still going to leave that, you know, gap. Um, and, and again, I, I know somebody's going to dog me about wearing gloves. I like it. Um, I think it's a lot wiser to wear some gloves. Um, you're handling chemicals all day. You're around sharp things. Um, and it's also a lot better too, guys. If you do cut your hands, you put another glove on, it's gonna keep that wound from getting more and more dirt and gunk into it. I also like that they're powder free, so there's no stuff. You, you just have to put them on when your hands are dry. Other than that, that's really about it. And then they, uh, these other ones, man, these black ones, I've torn them just trying to take them off my hand before. Um, so we've got that, we'll, we'll use that. I mean, it was a hundred bucks, or sorry, a hundred of those for like, 17 or 18 dollars at Lowe's um again I would get them if nothing else um but again these things will last they work really well I still have good grip the uh, the dragon grip the orange ones uh that power wash store sells those are pretty solid too um I think they're a little bit more expensive uh for them but I do like how um the tactileness with the textured grip and everything that you can get just that better um fit and everything so again saying no to these ones yes to these there we go um hope that helps guys um i will post a link to where you can get these on amazon 
um, again, for, for 24 cents a glove or whatever it works out to, uh, depending on if you buy them in bulk or not, um, it's nothing. Yeah, guys, it's literally cheaper to put those gloves on than to probably take the time to go bandage up a cut wound. And uh, especially when it's cold outside, guys, it's nice to have your hands inside some gloves. And sometimes we'll even put, um, you know, like actual work gloves on, on top. So this kind of keeps it waterproof. The rest of it gives you the more grip and just kind of that more protection. So have a great day.